It's olive harvest season in Palestine. What is traditionally a fun activity, Israel's decades-long occupation has turned into a scary and life-threatening endeavor. Here in a village near Tolkerem, Israeli settlers and the military fired live ammunition at Palestinian farmers and solidarity activists who posed no threat to anyone. The harvest, which took place on privately owned Palestinian land, lasted about two hours, with everyone rushing and stressed while armed Israeli settlers threateningly watched over them from the neighboring Jewish-only Israeli settlement built on stolen Palestinian land. Meanwhile, the Israeli military forced the people farther and farther down the hill as the soldiers flashed their guns and threatened to tear gas everyone if they didn't leave. At the same time, in a nearby village east of Jenin, the Israeli military shot dead a 60-year-old old Palestinian woman while she was harvesting her olives. Violent settler attacks on Palestinian farmers have long been a factor of Palestinian life in the occupied West Bank. But since October 7th, these attacks have gotten exponentially worse. And this year, we're seeing attacks pretty much every day. Still, like the olive trees themselves, Palestinians are standing rooted and resilient on their land.